So we the public are here and it's time for you guys to open up. Oh, well, we're finishing up our non-public, so we'll be opening in a few minutes. Okay? Mm, not okay, actually. This edition of the Ridley Report is brought to you by LRN.FM. Feds don't want you to hear them. So it's 12 o'clock, actually 12.11, and the open meeting was supposed to start at noon, yet I haven't seen anyone come out of there, so I'm going to kind of check and see what's going on. I'm still in there, going strong. So I did not come out of non-public yet. But it is scheduled to have a public meeting at noon, correct? That's right. So we the public are here and it's time for you guys to open up. Oh, well, we're finishing up our non-public, so we'll be opening in a few minutes. Okay? Not okay, actually. All right, well, let me uh, tell our board council your concerns. All right, thanks. Okay, now we've been, the doors have been open. I've been allowed in. Are you on the board? The Board of Medicine? Who are you? It's Dave Ridley with RidleyReport.com. I'm sorry. Dave Ridley, RidleyReport.com. It's like a poor man's TV station. Are you on the board or not? To what extent does the board enforce federal law? Are you on the Board of Medicine? Question for you. To what extent does the Board of Medicine enforce federal law? And to what extent are you not transparent? Yeah, it's a big... I understand that board members are actually appoint or well, nominated by other board members. Are you on the board? Yes, I am. Question for you: To what extent does I, my understanding is that the you have you have to be nominated by the board to be on the board? Is that correct? No, that's incorrect. Oh, okay. Sorry, in nominated, that case. Nominated uh, by the governor and confirmed by the executive council. Okay, good. Glad to hear that. Excuse me. I have a friend who was trying to become a doctor and gave up on it because the process is so bureaucratic and involved. What have you done for your position of power to make it easier to become a doctor? Uh, my position of power, you mean to become a, go to, go to medical school? Well, to, uh, to to enter the medical profession. Well, that starts in high school and college, so that's out of my area of uh, power. Are there any bureaucratic rules that you have that are making it easier for us to have a doctor shortage in New Hampshire? And that the, Medi the Board of Medicine is responsible for? I don't know how to answer that question, I'm sorry. So the, the, the Board doesn't make any rules? Are you on the Board of Medicine? Why did you folks continue meeting non-public for 15 minutes after the public session was supposed to start? So how common is it for them to continue meeting after, like, for 15 minutes Sir, after I'm the... I'm sorry, I'm not able to answer your questions. So, so here's the, the door you have to go into to get to that allegedly public meeting. In addition to the, of course, the locked door of the meeting itself. At this supposedly secure government complex. I guess the locked business is consistent with secure, but not very consistent with open government. No, can't do that. Federal agents on the streets of Keene, New Hampshire. They're investigating reports of an unlicensed radio station 
said to be broadcasting LRN.FM. So why all the fuss? What is LRN.FM? Well, it's probably not something these agents want you to listen to. It's a 24-hour news talk broadcast, all pro-liberty. A true authoritarian free zone. Tune in at LRN.FM to listen or broadcast their signal. LRN.FM Feds don't want you to hear them.